a g Squad. Welcome back to my episode of Is It Worth It? So this episode right this cool amazing model right here in my hand. And basically what this is, is a running armband that you can put stuff on here such as your phone, your cash, your earpods, or even your keys in here on the side right here if you guys want to. So there's obviously a lot of these out there available for you guys and they're all universal. Some of them fits up to like a certain phone. But first thing first, I'm actually opening a product to show you guys what the product looks like right here first. So when you open up, you guys can see that this is basically what the product looks like right here. And then on the back side, this is what it looks like right here. Let me take it out first. All right, so when we take it out, you guys can see that this is basically what it looks like right here. And we turn on the other side, this is what it looks like right here. So supposedly what they mentioned on the listing itself is the fact that they made an upgraded version of the zipper compartment right here. So I guess the older one couldn't fit as much stuff or something, but this one can definitely fit a lot more. We actually put a little bit of cash here and you can put like your ear pods in here as well, which I'll do a test in a second. And then in terms of the touch screen right here, they mentioned that it's touch sensitive. So you definitely still use the product itself while the phone is inside right here, which is super nice. They mentioned for this product itself is multi-humanized design. So there's definitely a lot of features that's on the product itself right here. If you guys are wondering what are all the features on the product itself, you guys refer to this image right here. So you can see right here, it has a silicon non-slip material right here. So that way when you actually put it on, it won't like keep moving around or whatever. It just stays in place, which is super nice. This part right here, once you guys open it up, that is basically how you guys put the phone inside right there. This part right here also has the Velcro to like stick it on right there to seal it back in. On the bottom part right here, you can see it has three different holes right here. So you can definitely use it to put like your headphones or you can use it to charge your phone right here as well. The overall material on the flap right here is waterproof and water resistant. So if you guys do plan on using this in the rain when you guys are running or whatever, you don't have to worry about any water getting onto it. And here's the really cool thing about this product in particular. If I open up this part right here, it's really hard and notable for you guys to see right here, but if you guys hold this part up right there, they have a little secret compartment right there where you can put your keys, your cards, or even your cash in here as you want to. But you probably don't want to put too much stuff in here to make it super noticeable and also makes it inconvenient for you guys or uncomfortable when you actually put it on. But it's definitely really cool how they have that little secret compartment right here so people don't know what's on here. But you guys can see the overall product itself is pretty high quality material right here. And they mentioned something about how they have a triple Velcro design right here as well. So literally all you guys need to do is slide it through here like this and just drop it around your bicep right here and start using it. So let me actually put on the phone right here and put in my ear pod to show you guys what it actually would look like if you guys would have it on. So let's take out the sample card right here first and then we'll put my phone inside. I'm gonna try to see if I can put it in with my case inside first. All right, so I have my phone inside right there, my case on. If I touch the screen right there, you guys can see that it does work. So you can see I'm on my Instagram page right here. If I wanna like scroll down, you guys can see that it's pretty sensitive. So you guys don't have to worry about not being able to use your phone with the actual product itself on right here, which is pretty awesome. So if you guys want to change your music or whatever on here, you definitely can. But you can see that the phone itself can definitely be put in here with a case on if you guys have the iPhone 12 Pro. I'm not 100% sure if it fits the case if you guys use it for like your iPhone 11 Pro Max or like iPhone 12 Pro Max. But for the iPhone 12 Pro, it actually works with the case on. Now I'm actually putting my AirPod on the side right here. So I want to open up right here. When I put my pen inside right here, you guys can definitely see this very spacious. So if I were to put my headphone inside right here, put it all the way, you guys can see the ear pods fit inside right there. So definitely there's a lot of space for you guys to put a lot of stuff on here. And if it doesn't fit right here for whatever you guys want to put in here, you definitely still have that sleeping compartment right here to put your cards or keys in the back right here as well. So that is basically what the product looks like right here. Let me strap it around my arm and show you guys what it actually looks like. All right, so if I were to strap it around my arm right here while I'm running, you guys can see that this is basically what it looks like. So obviously if it's too tight, you guys can always adjust it to your own preference to make it looser or tighter. But usually it's better for you guys to make it tighter so that way it won't fall off. But you can see that right there. So it definitely is pretty noticeable if people see your phone right here. But at least your hand is free, so that way you guys don't have to hold your phone while you're running, which is super nice. And that way if you guys want to just carry like a water bottle, you can just carry a water bottle and nothing else. That way you can actually carry less. But you can see that actually product itself definitely works pretty well. When I actually feel this product itself, it's definitely like a huge upgrade compared to my older version of my running arm bed that I used to use for, I believe, like the iPhone 7 or iPhone 8. This one definitely feels like a higher quality product and you can put a lot more stuff on here, such as the AirPods, your keys, etc. My old one, I couldn't even put anything else other than just the phone itself. So once you guys are done, you can just take it off and you can put it back to your table or whatever you guys need to. And like I mentioned, if you guys want to, you guys can even charge your phone on here. Just open up this compartment right here plug in the cable and start charging your device. If you guys have headphones, you can plug it in here as well and plug it for your phone and listen to music like that. But if you guys have like AirPods or AirPods Pro, 
you guys don't have to worry about it. So that is basically everything that's on the product itself. Now that we can unboxing and testing the product itself, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for me, honestly, I would definitely have to say that any kind of like running arm bags in general that's similar to this one right here, where it has the touch sensitive screen, the armband that's very strong, the fact that you can actually put a lot of stuff on here such as the slot base, your keys, your cash, your ear pods or whatever. Basically if the product itself is a similar design as this one right here where it has everything that it mentions right here, it's definitely super worth it. Especially if you guys run a lot, you guys don't want to carry your phone when you're running, this is very convenient. But then obviously for those guys who don't want or don't need one or have into one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.